So I received a question. Do professors actually teach the things that they study? And I will say yes and no. Because what you'll see is that in terms of your background, a lot of the professors may have done a bachelor's degree or a master's degree or a PhD in a different kind of subject. But the point was is that they were going to work in that area. So for example, in marketing, you'll see people that have PhDs in marketing, but also you'll see people that have PhDs in advertising or they'll have PhDs in psychology because that kind of fits. And so what happens when we're looking for professors to come work, they say, yes, you need the qualifications in this degree or a related field. So if they've studied a related field, then they can end up teaching that subject. And sometimes you might have what's called a clinical professor or a professor of practice and basically what they are is they have the real world experience and they're bringing that in the classroom. So they might have studied something completely different, but their work experience is perfect for the job that they're gonna be teaching and getting students ready for. But I will say, sometimes your professors get thrown into teaching classes that maybe it's not their really big forte, but those classes need to be taught. So they might be put into an area that they're not super comfortable with, but they've proven that they know the related subject, therefore they're able to learn the new subject and teach that. But overall, your professor should have a background or a similar background to the area that they're teaching to help bring that into the classroom. So for example, in my case, I actually did my undergraduate in marketing, my master's is in economics and management science, and my PhD was in management. However, I teach marketing. That's because I've actually have a lot of background in consulting in terms of marketing and branding, so that fit in right there. So my management degree was similar to marketing, but I had the real world experience to bring it into the classroom. So I hope that answered your question. I know it's a yes and a no and a maybe kind of thing, but uh, it's something I think is important to know. So if you have other questions that you want professors to answer, please put it in the comment section below and we'll try to answer your questions in a future video. And I'll say bye from here in beautiful Colmar, France.